Now, question, question. How many of you have come across the word that you weren't sure how to pronounce? Raise your hand. You come across a word that you didn't know how to pronounce. Have you? Yes? Okay, now, how many of you have no idea or you're not sure how to start to break down a word to pronounce the word? How many of you are not sure? Okay, all right. Well, would you like to learn how to break down a word into short syllables and pronounce the word all on your own without me? Yes? yes? Okay, great. That's what we're going to do today. Throughout the semester, throughout the trimester, you're going to be learning six types of syllables. Okay? Knowing how to identify these six types of syllables is the first step towards being able to break down a word and pronounce the word on your own. Okay? Would you like to learn the, what those six types of syllables are? Yes? 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 All right. Today, we're going to start with the first one. We're going to start with the first <laughs> syllable, and it's called the closed syllable. How many of you have heard of the closed syllable? Nobody? Ah, okay, good. So you've seen, all right, good. So let's get started, okay? Well, today we're going to learn about the closed syllable. Before I introduce you to the closed syllable, however, let me just do a quick review on what a syllable is. And you guys don't need to write anything down because I'm going to give you I'm going to give you copies of this. All I need you to do is just listen, follow along. So what is a syllable? What is a syllable? A syllable, you guys, is a group of letters that has a single vowel sound. For example, I have a group of letters here. This is a syllable. The vowel sound that I hear is the short O. Ah, goss. This is a syllable. Group of words, and we only have one vowel sound. E, D. This is a syllable. Group of letters, and we only hear one vowel sound. In this case, it's the short A. A, ban. Now you're probably asking yourself, Mr. Verdeen, how do I know what vowel sound that vowel makes in that, in that syllable? Well, that's what we're going to be learning today. You're going to identify the type of syllable it is and what sound that vowel makes. Okay? Because there's many different types of syllables. So let me get started on the syllable that we're going to learn today. And that syllable is called the closed syllable, okay? Now, there are three things you have to remember about the closed syllable. The closed syllable has only one vowel in it. The vowel has a short sound. And this closed syllable ends in a consonant, sometimes two. For example, closed syllable, we have one vowel. And I put vowel. I, that's what the V stands for. Ends in a consonant. And the vowel sound is short. If you remember, that's the symbol for the short sound. Short sound of the U, a uh, hus. Here we have another closed vowel. One syllable, I'm sorry, one vowel, it ends in a consonant, and the vowel sound is going to be short, e, eh, pen, okay? And it, as you can see again, another closed syllable. One vowel ends in a consonant, the vowel sound is short. So whenever you look at a syllable, if it has one vowel ends in a consonant, then we know that the vowel sound is short. 